hello guys now in this particular video learning about the if else conditions okay so let's start with the video and uh, i hope you are aware of if else but if not then let me tell you first what about what is this so basically if if, if else what happens if there will be one condition if that condition satisfies it it is true then the whatever the statement you write inside that if block that will execute okay so without wasting time first of all let me uh, tell you about uh, like how will we write this script so that will be easy to understand for you so 09 i will write here if else dot sh okay we are good to go now okay bin bash okay so here just suppose this in a equal to 10 okay if uh, i will write if and the condition is written inside this uh, big bracket okay and here you have to do if a equal to 10 okay so then you have to write like this then then what what do you want if this condition satisfy you have to write like this you can do anything here i am doing just printing like a is equal to 10 okay and you can do like in else you can write like this echo a is not equal equal to 10 okay and then to close the if log you can write like this fi so i will run this script but before that we will need to add the permissions 0 9 it is yeah clear the screen dot slash 0 9 9 okay 0 9 yeah a is equal to 10 what if i do 11 here and run this script so in this case this condition will not satisfy okay so how we can do it 0 9 a is not equal to 10 so i hope you got it how this thing work like if conditions so we will take the scenario of uh, voting system like uh, there will be person age we will take the input from the user i will just uh, comment out these things okay read and i will do here uh age okay or i will prompt for the user enter your age here i will do age okay and we will apply the conditions on this if age where is the dollar if age is greater than equal to 18 in this case we will write echo you are eligible to cast vote okay in else condition what we can write echo you are not eligible to cast vote okay and we have to just close this if block control is to save clear the screen enter your age 23 you are eligible to cast vote again 12 you are not eligible to cast vote okay if uh, or i can just do a greater than okay and i use one more thing that is elif it's also like the if but if this condition fails it will check for this particular condition here i will write if uh, age equal to just equal to i will use equal to 18 so in this case i want Eco, please apply for voter ID card. Okay, and here we will not use then. So now what we can do? Clear the screen, run the script. I will write my age equal to 18. So, so, so what happened? Okay, okay. I think we will write then. okay yeah please apply for 
voter ID card. Okay, so this is the LF condition. That's why we will need to write it then. Okay, so right now what's happening? Whatever the with the age we are entering. So here it is first checking this condition. If this condition fails, it will come upon this condition. So now this condition executes. That's why it is um, uh, giving the output as this line. Okay, what if the output doesn't match with uh, any condition? In this case, what will happen? The else condition will execute. You are not eligible to pass towards. Simple. Okay. So in this way, you can use if elif else conditions in your projects. Okay. So that's all for today's videos, guys. I hope you liked it. You will get the source code of this particular video in our GitHub repository. You can get it from there also. Okay. So that's all for today's guys. I will meet you in the next video. And thank you for watching.